Let's start with fifth part. So it says, can the quadratic polynomial x square plus kx plus k have equal zeros for some odd integer k is greater than 1? So here the condition given is that they have equal zeros. So this you will learn in chapter number 4 that whenever we have equal zeros, we have a term discriminant and in that we have b square minus 4ac equals 0. So this is the condition for b square minus 4ac when we have equal 0. So here we have b square minus 4ac equal to 0. So b in this case is k. So k square minus 4. a here is 1. The coefficient of x square. c here is k. So in this case what we can do is we have k square. We have 4k equals 0. Now what we can take common is k. We are left with k minus 4 equals 0. So now here we have two values of k that is k equals 0 and k minus 4 equals 0. So k is 4. So we have two values here that is k equals 0 and k is equal to 4. So here you can see it says that for some odd integer k greater than 1. So here we have two values of k that is equal to 0 and k equals to 4. So in this case it is very much clear that k is greater than 1. So therefore we can say the given quadratic polynomial has equals 0, equal zeros at k equals to 4. Because the condition here says that k is greater than 1. So we need to ignore k equals 0. So the value for k is 4. Which shows that there exists no value of k where the quadratic polynomial k x square plus kx plus k have equal zeros for odd integer k greater than 1. So it is very much true. The value is very much true here. So this is your answer for question number 5.